architecture had to be grand. It had to have a Georgian flavour about it. The brief was that simple. It had to include formal spaces and informal spaces. They could entertain formally and informally. I love the view from the road when you're looking down that classic ironwork, down through all the pines and to the front of the house. It has, has a wonderful, I feel, a very welcoming feel. The architecture is a simple architecture. It's, it's a classical and timeless architecture. It is now 2016, and uh, the house has a timeless flavour to it, has a timeless design to it. One of the main briefs of this house was to create a family home. And it's a very impressive home, and it's really, really interesting, very classical. And we've achieved this by using fresh, bright, happy colours, joyful colours. The family area overlooks the terrace and the swimming pool, which is wonderful. And look at this fantastic kitchen. They really wanted a, a classic finish to the house, which we have achieved by the shape and the, the styling of the furnishings throughout. One of my favourite areas in the house is the front hall, which is, is the, this colonnade with all these fantastic Indian sculptures that we found and put them there, which have a feeling of guarding the, the house itself. The rugs, of course, are all custom designed for this house. I love this room. It, even though it's very formal, it has a very casual feel. And looking through the front doors and back through the the windows and past the staircase, it has this wonderful open, airy feeling. The main objective really is make a family home and a family has grown up in this home and it was very important that it reflect the personality of the family which are a lot of fun and this house feels exactly that. It is a home more so than a house because it's going to be here for a, a very, very long time. It's like uh, the legacy I leave. So that's what I've left for future generations. Very proud, very proud.